what's up danny gang welcome back to our channel y'all i'm coming back <clears throat> just to chat with y'all see what y'all are up to um i'm gonna try to post at least once a week i'm not gonna say i'm gonna post three times like i used to oh i forgot my oil ring out um but i don't plan on being out that long today y'all because it's super gloomy and i'm really just not feeling it i really want to just go home and like do my closet my closet looks crazy i'll probably show y'all the before and after but welcome back to our channel welcome back to the vlogs y'all it is sunday and i am headed to run a couple errands i'm about to run an aldi real quick because we need some sweet relish we got a lot of grilled chicken that we didn't eat so we need to go ahead and do something with it so i'm gonna go ahead and grab some relish and see if there's anything else we need in aldi i don't think so because i got everything else from target like water frozen fruit um, we already have fruit at home. We got a lot of protein at home, but I did grab some ground turkey. I'll show y'all, of course, all the groceries once I get them home. I didn't buy like sodas or anything because we already had that. So y'all, I am just super excited. This is the first full week back home from vacation. And I'm very excited about it because y'all know I love a good routine. Um, I did want to come back and just chop it up with y'all and let y'all know my like final thoughts <clears throat> about the cruise. So this part might be a little lengthy. Um, I'm gonna park, talk to y'all, and then we'll go in Aldi. Y'all know Aldi on a Sunday can get crazy. So um, I'm trying to figure out really, okay, people just running crazy. Um, that's what I'm saying. Aldi really do, just be doing the most. But I wanna give y'all like my last impressions of the cruise and would I do it again and all that jazz. So I thought it was a park here, but it's not. Go ahead, girl. So welcome back to our channel. Like I said, we're just gonna like do a reset today. Nothing too crazy. I'ma just park over here, y'all, because it's a lot going on at Aldi. But um, the cruise. So thank y'all so much for all the love on the last video. Over a thousand views, which is crazy. I hadn't even checked the views in a while, so I didn't even know it was over a thousand views. So shout out to y'all. Um, so y'all know my man took me on a cruise really for my birthday. Uh, my birthday was in July, but we went in September because that was like the next cruise. We flew to Miami, um, and then we took um Carnival Sunrise, boarded the port of Miami, and it was a good time. So that was our very first cruise, and that's why the footage was what the footage was. I was vlogging, but I also was learning. So as it being our first cruise, it was a lot of things, everything we didn't know. Of course, we watched videos and we researched, but it was a lot of things that we did not know and we didn't learn until we got on. I will say I don't know if I'll go on another cruise. If I do, it'll definitely be like maybe another cruise line. I will say that the buffet food, I did not enjoy and the people was just nasty over it wasn't you know just touching stuff so we opted to eat like at the restaurants inside of the cruises inside of the ships we ate at the restaurants we did the buffet one day and then of course we ate at guys burgers we ate at the seafood place which y'all saw but we mostly went to like the sunrise hotel or whatever it was the sunrise restaurant we went there majority of the evenings because the food was just a better quality and we enjoyed it so about the food the food was really good like we had a good time with the food we just didn't really do the buffets we also frequented the pizza late nights we stayed up late like every night of the cruise um comedy shows going to um the club so i will say carnival every hour they have something going on which was very exciting so even if you didn't want to get off at the ports when you got to the different places you did not have to of course that's why we took the cruise so we got off in the bahamas and then we got off at half moon k we did have to take a itty bitty water shuttle from the ship over to half moon k which we did not know we were gonna have to do but it was very interesting very exciting very fun very different and then of course we got off at the port of um 
Turks and Caicos. Now, Babe did not feel good when we got to Turks and Caicos, so we actually took a taxi into town to go to the grocery store, and I showed the prices. They do use U.S. dollars, which is crazy, because the prices of the stuff was crazy. Um, so that was nice to learn. We got a tour as well um, on our way into town, as y'all heard in the last video, which was really nice. We did not plan any excursions, because like I said, it was our first cruise. We really didn't know what to expect. We didn't know what was going to be at the ports if there were things to do now if we do go on another cruise i definitely see us like doing excursions just to you know make more fun and see more things but we had a bomb time like i said comedy show was funny the club was popping music was lit which i showed in the last vlog so if you haven't watched the last vlog go watch the last vlog but uh we had a lot of fun i will say though i would love to go on a cruise with no kids because unfortunately the people next to us they did have a child which was screaming a lot of the time which made our trip unpleasant a little bit because you know we want to come relax and it seemed like they never left the room like i don't understand how people go on the cruise but y'all never leave the room like every time we came to the room to like change or whatever they were in the room i'm like when are y'all not in the room so that was a little bit annoying but the drink package 100 worth it it was almost a thousand dollars like 700 something and that was for the whole five days it was unlimited water unlimited soda unlimited mixed drinks daiquiris shots beers um gatorade anything you can think of unlimited bottled water everything unlimited so we drank our weight in alcohol we had shots and shots and shots um and it was very exciting i encourage anybody to get the drink package not only for alcohol but just for sodas water juice um gatorade anything because you want to replenish because it is hot every place we went was hot like lava hot skin melting off hot so i definitely would say get the drink package enjoy that even if you don't drink if you don't drink they do have an unlimited bubbles package where you can get water and soda but baby we like to drink y'all know that so we got our money's worth like by the second day we had our money's worth i think one day we both drank all our 15 drinks and alcohol because the 15 drinks don't include alcohol the 15 drinks are just alcohol but with that package you still get unlimited water soda gatorade all that and i will say the juice and everything in the machines like by the buffet horrible water down nasty i think they push you to get either the bubbles or the drink package um but yeah we loved it we love seeing the different places that we went like i said bahamas um turks and caicos that was our favorite place the beaches were wonderful um i will say our favorite place on the ship to eat was the seafood place and guys burgers i love guys burgers y'all know i love burgers so that was really fun so overall i rate our trip probably like an eight out of ten only because the kids was getting on my nerves but yeah if y'all know a cruise line we should go on i know a lot of people say royal y'all let me know and if we do um go on another cruise we will definitely check that out uh, while we're here i do want to give a shout out to case cool they sent me over some cases for my phone and this one is clear it has this stand on it which is really nice so when you're watching tv you can kind of pop that stand off and also you can hold it if you're vlogging or whatever you can put your fingers through here but it's really nice because if you're like me i love to watch something while i'm eating or just watch something while i'm like at work working so you can prop it up and put your phone on there so shout out to case cool thank you so much for sending this over if you you guys want to get you one or look at them look into them i will leave everything linked in the description box the quality is absolutely amazing and it is so cute and so chic i went with clear but they have a lot of different um kinds so go check them out but yeah let's run it aldi and i will be back in our next clip i'm gonna try to make this video fun long engaging i'll show y'all grocery haul i'll show y'all my closet before and after because i need to run in target and get hangers because i need a lot of hangers um and then yeah we're just gonna keep this day going it was just friday the 13th if you guys follow me on instagram then y'all saw i set up a whole freaky friday night for me and babe and we watch movies and we had a good time so make sure y'all follow me on there since i'm not over here that often so yeah let's get into the video
All right, y'all, I ran in Aldi so, so quick. I do have a um, drive-up order at Target that I'm going to pick up. But first, we're going to go in because I'm going to grab some hangers and kind of, like, poke around. So, y'all can come with me. I know y'all probably miss coming with me and vlogging with me. So, I'm going to bring y'all. I'm going to bring y'all, like, chill, chill, chill. So, <laughs> let's go check out their little dollar spot. Even though, y'all, honestly, it's literally not a dollar anymore. It's, like, five to ten dollars which hey get your money so let's see what they got i do have a doormat at the door which i will show y'all i got mine from dollar tree because yeah oh this is so cute this is so cute now y'all know we do have some clear decanters on our bar but this is super cute that's cute. Y'all know I skip straight to Halloween to decorate. So I do have like some Halloween teens around the apartment because I don't really do fall like that. But, oh, this is cute. This is cute. It's kind of cold outside. This is cute too. I don't know the theme, y'all. Y'all know I never know like the theme or whatever. But I usually get some of these each year. Those are cute. But I don't know if I'm gonna do that right now. Like I said, I just wanted to look. Obviously, if I see something I need, I'll get. But, oh, that's cute. Finally, some peace and quiet. Welcome to our lair. Oh, these are cute. Oh, they're glass too. It's cute. Let's see. Oh, these are cute coasters. We don't really need nothing though, y'all. We really don't. Okay, let's go look for some hangers. All right, Danny gang. So yeah, y'all, we are back home and I'm just gonna quickly show y'all everything that we got. I do have this spooky cauldron in the background that I got from Dollar Tree that works so well. Hopefully you guys can see it in the corner. But anyway, I got groceries from Target and Aldi. We already have oranges, onion, tomato, cucumber, chicken breast, chicken wings. Um, we already have that stuff. I do have a case of water that I always get from Target. Not going to be in this video because it's heavy and it's literally just water. Um, but I'm going to show you guys everything that I got. So let's go ahead and just do Aldi first. I only got four things from Aldi. I just got some Imperial. We just like to have this just in the fridge. I wasn't sure if we had any. So it's like a dollar 24 i just grabbed some to just put in the fridge we're also going to make chicken salad like i said we got a lot of salad left over so i grabbed some sweet relish relish anywhere else is like three four dollars it's literally a dollar and 36 cent at aldi and it's a huge jar in comparison also from aldi i just grabbed this lasagna with meat sauce just to keep in the freezer because on nights that neither one of us want to cook this would probably be a good thing just to pop in the oven make you some garlic bread make you a salad call it a day this was like six bucks and it's huge lastly from aldi i just got my favorite creamer it's back it's the frosted sugar cookie the home alone from international delight again i know what people say about creamer and all that listen i'm gonna keep drinking creamer i couldn't see the sugar-free one obviously so i just got the regular one but again listen yeah then from Target, I just got some romaine hearts. We do a lot of salads, wraps, and stuff like that. So I got some romaine. That's the lettuce that we prefer. Um, <clears throat> then also they had this boneless pork shoulder butt roast on sale for $5 and some change. It was originally $17. It's huge. So I just thought we can get this, put this in a crock pot, maybe tomorrow before I go to work. And, you know, have this with some green beans or broccoli and mashed potatoes. I don't know, but it was a good price for a huge pork roast. Then got some ground turkey because we love to do ground turkey. Y'all know onions and bell peppers. Nothing's changed. So got that. Also, I got some zero carb mission tortillas. We can put chicken salad in here. Tacos, wraps, whatever you want to do. Um, another thing, these are on sale for $2 this week. So I got four of them. And they're just these um, Jimmy Dean Delights breakfast bowls. It's the turkey sausage, diced potatoes, scrambled eggs, and cheddar cheese. So 19 grams of protein, 
Um, so I just got four, two for me, two for babe. If he wants one or two or whatever, he can, you know, a couple days a week, just have a quick breakfast. Then grab some frozen fruit for like smoothies and stuff like that. So got some frozen strawberries, got some frozen pineapple and some frozen peaches. And then we got some canned goods, which I will show y'all. I got some green beans, I got some corn, <clears throat> I got some black beans and pinto beans. So got that, again, we already have rice and pasta and sauce and salad dressing. We pretty much got everything. These are just some ends, you know, odds and ends that I got. And then lastly, I got three things of hangers because I'm gonna do my closet. I'm definitely not gonna bring y'all along for the whole process because it's gonna take me forever. But I got three of these, it's 18 hangers. These hangers was like $3 at Target. I got three of them and we're gonna do my closet because anytime I walk in my closet, I get instantly depressed. So yeah, that's our little grocery haul. Let me show y'all my closet. Let me put everything away, show y'all my closet, and then I'm gonna redo it, so yeah. All right, y'all, I almost got started without y'all, so I'm happy that I remembered. So those are all the hangers I have. I have black hangers in my closet, but Target didn't have black, so we're just gonna rock with white and a couple black. <sighs> that's irritating, but I didn't wanna like go to a whole bunch of stores because I want to do it and then i started pulling stuff out so i just got hats and purses swimsuits but y'all this is the closet this is the closet so <laughs> as y'all know we have a two bed two and a half bath um i have my clothes in the second bedroom this is my closet as well as my bathroom is over here babe's closet is in the master and he uses the master bathroom um which works out perfectly y'all know i'm up and out the door and at work at 6 30 so it's perfect for me to leave the master suite and come over here and be able to make noise and get ready without disturbing him while he's sleep and then he get he goes to work after me which is perfect now the only thing is this closet is kind of odd so you got those shelves up there those shelves right there you got these little hanger space and then i just had like these little cubbies right here with like underwear socks t-shirts and then here is where i just have y'all three totes just full of clothes purses gym bags backpacks and then there are my shoes and my dirty clothes hamper it looks crazy and i cannot function so yeah i'm not gonna bring y'all along for the strenuous journey that i'm about to embark on it's literally 1 14 yes i was listening to kevin gates it's 1 14 let me get to work and i will bring y'all back when i'm done and show y'all and then show y'all the time hopefully it don't take too long and hopefully i'm able to throw a lot of stuff away but i just don't know because if i try to hang like dresses or something here it's gonna fall into these bins and I kind of like these bins. So let me see what I can come up with. Up there is like overflow gym clothes. So let me just see what I can do. <laughs> I will be back. All right, y'all. So it's 2.12 and I'm done for the day. I have not done any type of color coordinating or anything like that. I'm tired, but this is what we got. So if you remember the previous clip, now, here we are so i still have my dirty clothes hamper right there i hung up everything so we got like pants and stuff right there then here's like all my t-shirts that i wear the most i also pulled out like all of my halloween t-shirts which i pull out every year like my billy loomis shirt and all that then i have my sweaters i have jackets um vests raincoats and thicker coats a couple of dresses work uniforms up there is like um stuff to decorate my kindle more gym stuff and then that's more like t-shirts and stuff up there's just some amazon boxes i don't really know what i'm gonna do it and then here is just like dresses then a couple keepsakes but and then in here i kept these the same so it's like underwear socks bras pajamas and then this is just like overflow pajamas and t-shirts so y'all i am tired i'm gonna go oh and then of course i just picked up all my shoes and put them up straight so yeah y'all i'm gonna go ahead and probably in this vlog right here because i am so tired but i just wanted to come talk about the cruise do a little grocery reset and do my closet so with that being said see y'all in the next one bye all right, y'all, and since I am meal prepping, I guess I'll go ahead and show y'all kind of what we got going on. So y'all know I love to make the ground turkey with the vegetables and the hoisin sauce. So 
I had this last week and I think the week before and I've really been enjoying it. So made that and it is just cooling. Also, babe got some chicken. So I just seasoned it with the mojito lime seasoning, um, a little bit of adobo and oil and water. And I'm gonna have some dinner with this tonight. Here is the less leftover chicken I was talking about earlier. I'm gonna make some chicken salad. So I've got some mayo, a little bit of relish, and then this is the relish that I got from Aldi. So yeah, we're just gonna make some chicken salad and y'all know you can eat this with crackers, wraps, whatever. And then over here, I just got some jasmine rice cooking. I don't wanna open it because yeah, you just not supposed to open it. So got some jasmine rice cooking and then I'm gonna go ahead and cut up some lettuce and have that prepped as well. So that's what we got. So here is the rice. I just do a cup of jasmine rice, season it, put a little butter, let it cool off. So babe and I can just get some throughout the week. Whenever you want some rice, it's already made in the fridge. And then this is how I prep our salad. So y'all saw the romaine I bought. I just wash it, I cut it up finely and I put it in here so that we can just grab it for salads, wraps, whatever. It makes it easier for me and especially babe because he's always like on the go. So I just do it like that and that way it's all cut up. And typically I would if we need onions or bell peppers for the week, I will also cut those up, but I'm not going to cut any up today. Um, and I'm not going to cut any cucumber or tomato, but we do have it. I might actually, but anyway, I'm in the vlog. Y'all have a good one. Hopefully y'all are watching football. Leave your team down below. Y'all know it's always going to be go, pet, go. Have a good week. Bye.